what's up you guys another coffee video so if you guys watched um the last coffee video i posted i used the stoke um cold brew coffee but it was the green label which was unsweet and i was excited to find the not too sweet um black cold brew so i picked this up because i want to give it a try and see how it tastes um usually when i go to the grocery store i never see any other different stokes i always only see the green label um stoke i was surprised to see this plus two more different ones and i don't even think they had the green label this time so i grabbed it up super quick um and i'm gonna try it for the first time the cream i picked was caramel i usually get caramel macchiato cream in the coffee mate um so this will be my first time trying the caramel i wanted to try something different but they had so many to choose from i could not decide so i just went with this one and then i'm going to use a different syrup than i used the last time i think it was just plain caramel syrup this one is salted caramel in the tarani i think that's how you say it um i got this from myers and these two i found at a grocery store called kroger's last time i had got my products from walmart um i have my coffee cup here but i'm gonna use this to make my coffee in because i did go to tim hortons this morning i had to get coffee to go buy the coffee <laughs> so yeah i have um ice in my cup already i kind of wanted to fill it up but i don't want it to be too much to where i cannot stir it um also the last time i did use um i made my collagen coffee today i'm not going to make the collagen coffee i'm just going to make just a regular plain cup of coffee so i can get some energy and edit a video for you guys so i did share on my TikTok, um, the different creams and the different coffees that I seen at the grocery store. They did have the pumpkin flavored creams and coffee out, but I've never even tried pumpkin pie. I've tried pumpkin nothing, just pumpkin seeds. <laughs> Cause I just, I don't know. I feel like pumpkin flavor is just gonna taste weird. I don't know. Um, so I didn't get anything pumpkin, but now that I didn't, I'm kind of wanting to try um, a pumpkin cream and see how that tastes. If you guys have tried pumpkin cream, pumpkin coffee, or you know anything pumpkin flavor, let me know and what do you think of the flavor? Because um, <clears throat> now I'm a little curious. Since it's just, I hear it's good, it's always all the rave when um, fall season comes around and Halloween, it's just, you know, the drink to have something with pumpkin in it so now i'm curious so yeah um first i'm going to go ahead and pour in my salted caramel i want a little bit in the bottom of the cup i don't never measure stuff y'all so don't go by my measurements put however much you want so that's about how much i put in there it's a little bit so i'm gonna add a little bit more once i get done the, this time also i'm not gonna put sugar i'm gonna taste it first let me shake it up a little bit more first get that caramel syrup mixed up into it only thing that I'm missing that I like to have is the thick caramel to go around the side of the cup. I've been looking for the Ghirardelli um, caramel and I have not came across it yet, but I do need some caramel. I'm a little heavy on the cream. My little frother stirrer needs batteries in it and i keep forgetting to put batteries in it so i'm using a good old tim horton straw you guys this is not my straw the straws i have are 
plant-based and eco-friendly. <laughs> I mentioned that in my last video because um, in my one video where I was drinking that ginger shot, someone thought I was drinking out of a plastic straw, but I was actually drinking out of plant-based eco-friendly straw, compostable straw. And they didn't ask me first, they just got mad, so yeah. <laughs> All right, so I'm gonna do a little bit more coffee, top it off. Ooh, yummy. So that's what it's looking like. Mmm, looks good. Give it a taste. Oh my God, yum. Let me tell y'all, I love sugar, okay? Especially in my coffee. <clears throat> and what I like about this Stoke is that you don't really need sugar. Now, the last time I made that coffee, I didn't know that the unsweet Stokes is still, it wasn't like bitter tasting or nothing like a regular coffee. Um, but the cream would have been enough sugar in this as well so i didn't need any sugar in it last time when i made the next cup i didn't put sugar in it and it was even better so this is really good without the sugar in it this is so good it's not super sweet or anything like that at all yum yeah y'all so if you see this one try it i think i will try the next one that i see as well they did have a pumpkin a stoked um, pumpkin flavor cold brew as well so yeah I don't know if you guys have a Kroger grocery store in your area but that's where I found this one and I saw the pumpkin one and I forgot what the other one was I think it was another label of unsweet or something I can't remember if I don't forget I'll put a little clip or picture in here and show you guys my TikTok video but yeah y'all so that's it I just wanted to make this new coffee with y'all and give it a taste and see how it was and it's really good 10 out of 10 Make sure to give this video a thumbs up and thank you guys for watching.